What's up guys, Luke again and welcome to the second episode of 500k in a day. This is going to be the first actual trading video, but if you're looking for any cheaper and reliable ultimate team coins, make sure you go to gofeefcoins.com. Link will be in the description down below as well as the discount code to get 5% off. Now, we started off with about 1.5k. I think that's what I had left on this account from my last training series. I think it was around that anyway, I'm not too sure. But, they're the three players we bought. We bought, I think it was a Rosenberg and um, some PSV right wing and a Danilo who actually sold instantly for 1.1k and then we're just going to be using silver players until we can get a decent amount to start trading with informs but I'm hoping you guys can absolutely smash the likes on this series because I'm going to be uploading one video every single hour so make sure you keep it locked on this channel make sure you remember to come back every hour on the dot the videos might not go live then because of YouTube publishing issues but Hopefully it will be okay, but I'll definitely have a video every hour. So as you can see, these are the players that we've been training with. Um, but you, like we started off with a couple of silvers. Now we've got Lamar, the um, Swansea left midfielder that's Belgium. We converted him. Well, he was we bought him in a converted position for 3k. I think with the system for 5.6, which was a pretty good deal. And Minor profits is just going to help us. We got two right forward Walcotts with Hunter on for 2.9k. We've got one for 2.9. We're going to start one up at five. We got this one for 2.7. We're going to sit up at five or 4.9. Yeah, we think we're going to list this one up. Oh, we're going to one up at 5k as well. And then we go and pick up two silver players. And silver players are actually so easy to trade with. If you want to see a video at the end of this series. Um, of all the meth different methods that I've used, and let me know in the comments down below. As you can see, now we're going to pick up some Dries Mertens in left wing with Hunter. As you can see there, there's one for 3k that we actually managed to pick up, and I don't know what the other cheapest one was, but it was quite cheap anyway. And after we list these up, it'll be really, really good because training with converted wingers and wingers with Hunter on is really effective because I think the Hunter card goes for like 5k, so essentially, you're buying a player for like you can buy him for, and then just instead of buying them separately, you buy them with the hunter card on, which is obviously what most people would do. But with this, like, it's just easier to trade with them. That's what I'm trying to actually say. Um, I'm getting on my words messed, messed up. That's not good. But I'm gonna have another video out in an hour, which it's gonna be hard to get out. But I'm gonna try and do it anyway. And um, yeah, like I was saying, we've got this Mertens here for 3k. Glisted him up for 7k, I think, or 6.8 to actually undercut myself. And as you can see, by the next deal that we get, um, we're actually picking up some very nice deals. Uh, like the two, Both of the Walcotts did sell, and obviously we went and picked up a load more silver players. And yeah, the silver players are very, very good to trade with. My PC keeps fucking up and black screen as I'm trying to read out the players that I'm listing up but anyway we got a lot of silver players for 350 coins or less and yeah we list them up for around seven eight hundred we list them up I did list them up for eight an hour and a lot of them did sell in the first hour but obviously some don't due to people obviously not buying them but the more I've like I've learned like do you want to trade with the more popular players because if you look at all these players here and look at Adu this Freddy Adu guy I don't know what it was but he's he's got four star skills and he's actually I don't know he sells for 800 coins he's the last player to sell but I don't know it's just weird with him because he's actually a pretty good player to trade with and as you can see now we've got two things that I have sold and them two players are indeed the both the Mertens they have been converted back to different positions and then we're going to get this Quincy Uwisu Abey this 5 star skiller from the Hellas Liga there's only one on the market for 3.4k in with Hunter so we're going to buy ours buy it and list it for around I think it's around 6 or 7k I'm not too sure I can't really remember what I listed it for but whatever we list it for is going to be a nice profit anyway because he's one of the few 5 star skillers because there's not that many 5 star skillers on this game I found um, not as many as there was last year and the year before but the last few players that we're going to buy, is, look, you see there, Fidel Martinez, another 5 star skill. I think we get it for 3.2k. I think we're going to list him up for around 3, 4.3, sorry. Um, but yeah, if you could smash the likes on this video if you have enjoyed, make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. I'll have another video in another hour. Thanks for watching, I'll see you all next time. Bye.